On Southern Gas Corridor project, we participated mainly on TANAP, and actually on all four construction loads, we welded about 80% of the whole line. And uh, we also provided our field joint coating services and supplied a range of pipeline construction equipment. In particular, talking about automatic welding, we welded a 56-inch pipe on lot 1 and 3 and 48-inch section on lot uh, 4. We also mm, welded a, a bit on lot 2, about 20 kilometers. All in all, it's uh, close to 100,000 wells equal to 1,200 kilometers, which was probably one of the biggest projects in CRC Evans' uh, history. Prior to the start of the project, we received some pipe from ArcelorMittal, 56-inch pipe with a request uh, to weld it using our st standard welding procedure. What we did, we didn't know the uh, pipe composition or any other properties of the steel, but what we understand, the results uh, came out good, so we've seen the mechanical properties uh, of, uh, of the weld. They exceeded uh, the project specification. And our understanding was that it was a trial a project to see whether the pipe material can be used for TANAP. On TANAP itself, uh, we had to qualify a number of different procedures for each plate manufacturer and for each pipe supplier. So the pipe came from different sources. I believe several uh, Turkish pipe mills were involved in supply of pipe to TANAP, as well as some uh, longitudinal welded pipe came from bow steel in from China. So, but I have to admit that for us it really didn't make any difference. Yeah, we used our standard welding procedure and in, in the course of construction, we, our technicians, our personnel wouldn't really know uh, where the pipe came from. So there was a mix of different uh, pipes uh, depending on the wall thickness. We uh, received pipe uh, 19, 22 and 29 millimeter wall thickness and we welded whatever came to, to, to the line at a particular point of time. Yeah. Well, CRC Evans is really proud to be part of a pipeline of such scale, working with experienced pipeline contractors, uh, engineering companies, uh, pipe suppliers. It was probably one of the most challenging projects we attempted ever in, in our history and we, we are happy it completed with good results and good quality.